Welcome to your daily devotional, My Life Today, December, and Eternal Life. December 1st, Make Your Calling and Election Sure, Preparing for Eternal Life. Wherefore, the rather, brethren, give diligence to make your calling and election sure, for if ye do these things, ye shall never fall, for so an entrance shall be ministered unto you abundantly into the everlasting kingdom of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Second Peter 1 verse 10 and verse 11 Here a life insurance policy is offered us which ensures for us eternal life in the kingdom of God. I ask you to study these words of the Apostle Peter. There is understanding and intelligence in every sentence. By taking hold upon the life giver who gave his life for us, we receive eternal life. We are each deciding our eternal destiny, and it rests wholly with us whether we shall gain eternal life. Will we leave the lessons given in the Word of God, Christ's great book lesson? It is the grandest and yet the most simply arranged and easily understood book ever prepared for giving an education in proper behavior in speech, in manners, in affection. It is the only book that will prepare human beings for the life that measures with the life of God. And those who make this word their daily study are the only ones who are worthy of receiving a diploma entitling them to educate and train the children for entrance into the higher school to be crowned as victorious overcomers. Christ Jesus is the only judge of the fitness of human agents to receive eternal life. The gates of the holy city will open to those who have been humble, meek, lowly followers of his, having learned their lessons from him and received from him their life insurance policy, forming characters after the divine similitude. When the ransomed are redeemed from the earth, the city of God will be opened to you. Then the harp will be placed in your hand, and your voice will be raised in songs of praise to God and to the Lamb, by whose great sacrifice you are made partakers of his nature and given an immortal inheritance in the kingdom of God. An Eternal Life, December 1st